Hello everybody, in this quick tutorial I will show you the latest updates we made to Face 3D. So these new features will certainly improve your workflow and let you make even cooler scenes. If you're ready, let's get started. Alright, so this is the Face 3D panel and as you can see it changed a little bit. As you well know, after installing Face 3D you need to sync it with Blender. So if you click on this Blender icon here and select Blender app, you will be prompted to go for a test run. So click yes, and if everything is fine, you will see the Blender software window appear. Now this is just for you to know that Face 3D and Blender are synced. All right, next update is UI color themes. Now because the new version of After Effects has this new ability to change interface color, we've added this feature to match your preferences. So now you can adapt the color theme to your liking. Light or dark, it's totally up to you. But the darkest is set by default. Also you can change highlight color. Choose a different color. All right, the next update has to do with saving folder directory. Now it is static. You don't need to specify the safe path each time. The folder you select is where all the models will go until you specify a different path, okay? Now some of you guys noticed that you couldn't actually see Blender indicator in the trial version. So we fixed that and it's not a problem anymore. Now about the most important thing in this update, which is that now you can relight your scene. If you try to add light, you will notice that the surface becomes kind of rough and uneven. So we fixed that. We optimized the mesh and smoothed it out. The model looks nice and the light falls just the way it should. Same thing in this scene. This is the old model. And as you can see, it doesn't look good. So let's change it to the new one we've created in the new version. There, looks much better now. And if you compare the sizes of models in the old and in the new versions, you will notice that size of the one we've created after this Phase 3D update has decreased quite a bit. See, now it's four times smaller. By adding light, you can change the actual mood of the scene. Like we can add more anxiety by adding this red alert light kind of signal. And you can find more info about relighting on YouTube. For example, there's a great channel called Tutorials View Plus. They actually recorded a very detailed tutorial on Face 3D. It's a good channel, it's very interesting tutorials. Go and check it out. All right, so that concludes our update. Thanks for watching and we'll see you later.